This is now my favourite part because we sent presenter Ryan Hand to surprise the woman at the heart of this close knit <gasps> community. You guys doing good? No, Ryan. Thank you, that's rude. The Clock Mills Crochet Club, headed up by May, is having its weekly get together. We've made out we're filming for a new live daytime show, and May believes she's been invited to take part in a segment about the growing popularity of crochet to be broadcast live on BBC One. Everyone else here knows what's really going on. But as May is told, we'll be going live in just a few minutes. There's just one problem. Our local TV presenter, Ryan Hand, is running late. I'm here to surprise May, who sounds like a fantastic woman. But first, Ryan is going to have some fun. I want to pretend that instead of chatting about crochet, I'm here to talk about the rising sport of croquet. Back at the hall, our team's keeping May up to date on Ryan's lateness. When he gets here, he'll lead you through it all. So That's good. You're going to be on your own. <laughs> That's good. Hello, 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 hello. Sorry, the traffic in Belfast. Maze clocked Ryan's crochet mallet, but he pretends to not notice the large signs marked crochet. And with our fake broadcast about to go live, there's no time to spare. How long have I got, Anthony? Uh, two minutes. Are you ready? Uh -huh. I'll get to go, okay. Ryan's ready to spring the day's first surprise. The first thing I will probably ask you is um, just why you fell in love with the sport of croquet and it's what made you set up this. It's not crookie, it's crochet. Crochet? It's crochet. 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 Oh my goodness. I, I be, I've been told that I'm doing a, an item on cr croquet. No, I don't know anything about crochet and all the questions I've prepared are, are about croquet. Do you mind if we just, just go with this? Could you pretend that we're actually at a croquet club? Is that okay? Mate's far too nice to say no. Although, with all those signs saying crochet, she's baffled. Can we make sure not to get any crochet in the background? So no, no crochet, just croquet. Oh. How long? Couple of seconds. May believe she's about to go live to the nation. Okay, here we go, here we go. You're gonna be great. We're in five, four, three, two. One of my favorite sports is croquet. So today I am here at the glorious Clock Mills Croquet Club in County Antrim, and I'm joined by an absolute legend of the game, May Atchison, who set up the club in 2013. May, how are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Now, May, what was it that made you fall in love with the sport, and why did you set up this magnificent croquet club? <laughs> well, I just thought it'd be good for the girls. And oh, get them out. right, okay. <laughs> now, May, I just want to see that trademark swing of yours. <laughs> Maybe a countdown from the girls, yeah? Ready, okay. Three, two, one. There we go! Ah. Not bad! Not bad! With a the, with the swing like that, you'll be making the Olympics soon, I'd say, oh, May. This has gone far enough. Ryan's coming clean. Now, May, um, I have a little secret. Oh. We're actually, we're not on live TV. And I actually know that you aren't a master croquet player, but you are indeed a master crochet stitcher. <laughs> now, I've been sent here by The One Show to say one big thank you to you for setting this club up and providing a real lifeline in the community. <laughs> I can't believe you've done that. <laughs> How does it feel knowing how appreciated you are? Just didn't think the girls appreciated it that much. I just love all these ladies. They're brilliant. And waiting outside, more of May's friends and family want to show their appreciation. <laughs> okay, May, this is your second surprise. Take a look at this, May. Hi May, it's Jermaine here from The One Show. We wanted to say one big thank you to you for everything you've done in your village. The work you do is truly a lifeline to some members of the group. And like us, many of them wanted to say thank you too. We'd like to thank you for all the hard work you've done and bringing the communities of Clotnells together. I want to thank May for making me feel so welcome and making me feel part of the whole community of the area. One of May's favourite celebs, Eamon Holmes, has this message for her. May, 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 what can I say except one 
big thank you. Well done you for bringing so many people together and helping them find new friendships. And another Northern Irish TV legend, Gloria Honeyford, also wanted to pay tribute. Hello May, I love the sound of the Clock Mills Crochet Group. Now what you actually do to combat loneliness and isolation, I think is amazing. And I promise you May, I will see you one day there with my needle and everything and I'll be ready. <laughs> and later on, local singing hero, Daniel O'Donnell, was keen to add his thanks too. Your crochet group sounds like a wonderful idea and very inclusive, so you certainly deserve this one big thank you. Oh. How do you feel, May, after seeing that? I'm just so amazed. I didn't think anybody thought as much of me as to do all this. Well, we all think you're an amazing person, May. This is unbelievable. I'll be torn with this for weeks. <laughs>